A jump ball in the corner, and it's knocked away. And the Penguins are national champions. The start of the 1991 National Championship season can actually be traced back six years to a 1985 news conference when on the weekend before Christmas, an unknown assistant from Ohio State named Jim Tressel was named head football coach at Youngstown State. A lot of people throw it, but, you know, we're going to complete it. In his first four years, Coach Tressel's record was a combined, much less than stellar, 23-24. and 24. Then, in his fifth season, YSU went 11-0, only to lose in the first game of the playoffs, which set up 1991. You know, the only thing I remember about going into that season was how disappointed we were with the way the season before ended. That year, Coach Trussell had all the seniors talk about what they were going to do to win a national championship. Chris Vecchione was a junior defensive tackle on the 91 team, which he says made a national championship its goal. But those goals were momentarily put on hold when, after seven games, YSU was four and three. Randy Smith was a freshman defensive back. We really had to, to have a gut check. It looks like very mediocre. This team was going to maybe struggle to get into the playoffs. Youngstown State's longtime play-by-play -play announcer Bob Hannon, along with the players and Coach Tressel, can all vividly remember game eight. But the Georgia Southern game, that was the turning point of the season. Four and three playing the defending national champions on their field, and they were 55 and two on their field. McGrady option left, turns it up, late pitch, oh, yeah. he's picked off. It's going to be a touchdown for the Penguins going the other way. Youngstown State beats Georgia Southern, which just so happens to also be the site of the 1991 national championship game. On his way out of town, Coach Tressel, always the motivator, stops at Georgia Southern's Eagle Creek, fills a jar with water, mixes it with water from the Mahoning River and puts it out for all to see. He says, we're going to bring this back down there in eight weeks. We're going to dump the Eagle Creek water back, mix with the Mahoning River water, and we're going to win the national championship. 